Peter Julius Moy, a reporter for Corporate Weekly who was shot twice in the back on Wednesday night, is the seventh journalist to be killed in South Sudan this year. The attack comes days after President Salva Kerr is reported to have threatened to kill reporters seen as working against the country. Our reporter Sarah Kimani joins us now on the line to give us more details regarding the shooting. Sarah, a very good afternoon to you. What have you uncovered in regards to this journalist's death? Is it really linked to Salva Kerr's recent utterances? Good afternoon, Alicia. What we want now is that uh, he's the seventh journalist to be killed under mysterious circumstances in South Sudan this year. And he was shot uh, as he was coming from work. He was from weekly, uh, a monthly magazine. Uh, but he's been a man the government and the world that has been on South Sudan for more than 20 months now. Sir, sir, what are the people on the ground saying? And do journalists feel safe working there now? Well, uh, this is uh, also uh, the whole thing to such an organic that we come out to say uh, you know, that more is also uh, going to raise attention uh, in terms of the uh, coaching fear among uh, people who are working uh, with whether foreign or local. Uh, the report is actually put to them at uh, number 125 out of 180 uh, among places where it's dangerous for journalists to work. So the latest killings, and now we're talking about seven journalists this year, just mean that it becomes one of the most dangerous places for journalists to work with. So unfortunately, we have such a bad line there. That was Sarah Kimani reporting to us on the death of the journalists in South Sudan.